Now, let me ask you, <laughs> which hair looks better, this or mine? Oh, I think the one on the left. <laughs> <laughs> That's the neatest thing. It's Mr. and Mrs. Potato here, oh. except they really are potatoes. Doris did that, and it's just wonderful. She has just ruptured herself you this year. you got the shallots stuff. and potatoes and mm -hmm. parsley. And what are these, Well, this Doris? does look a little like Jean Shallot, doesn't yeah. it? Right. The bottom of the brain. The oh, bottom the, oh, the bottom of the skin. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. You've heard of Leo Biscay. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, and uh, <laughs> all, just all of those. Oh, they're great. Well, we're, I'm going to be doing something with onions later on during oh, this good. program. I understand. Yeah, we can tell. Yeah, we can. Yeah, as a matter of fact, you can just cut that off just about any time. So we have to get things rolling here a little in advance of the program so everything will come off impeccably time-wise. Uh -huh. And you know how good we are at that. Oh, the mail continues to roll in. Dear sirs, this is from Jane Ursary in the Pleasure Park Campgrounds in Hot Springs, <laughs> Arkansas. <laughs> Saw your show on TV at Hot Springs and was interested in the Pleasure receipts Park. from other countries. Uh, the one I saw that day were Cuban. Please send them to me. Uh, my daughter is a missionary and is planning a, a taster's tea at church on foreign countries. <laughs> Good. I'm so glad we were able to help the missionaries with their work <laughs> and uh, especially, well, that you had the recipes before you go because I'm sure some of the people that you're going to see will have their own recipes and we won't go into all of those jokes. And what's the name of the campground? The Pleasure Park <laughs> Campgrounds. <laughs> I Park have one pleasure. here and this one says an awful lot. This one probably just says volumes. It speaks volumes without ever having read any of it and I'll tell you why in a minute. It says, Dear gentlemen, your program is great pity. It's on at 12 a.m. midnight. I will something wake up to see you please send me such and such recipes. And this is from our good, one of our good viewers out in Downey, California, but this sort of tells me something about California. This has been written on, uh, uh, th this letterhead has to do with drugs. <laughs> 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 These are probably the drugs that keep this person up so she can see the program. That's a right long, what is it? Non-rethadrone acetate tablets, five milligrams. Uh -huh, whatever right they are. On there. Thank you, and we hope you're enjoying them. Uh, the shows, of course, that's uh, what I'm talking yes, about. Yes, go ahead. Oh, 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 gee, it's two letters well, back to back. Yeah, that was so long I thought I'd leave. Tracy Massey of Richmond, Virginia says, Dear sir, saw your program for the first time tonight. Please let me know your showtime schedules for I had a good time watching all you guys joke back and forth. I laughed a lot with you guys. It sure was a trip. Sorry, I'm not sure of your names, but I think you work well with each other. Oh, good. That's nice. Uh -huh. We're glad you think so. Smack. <laughs> <laughs> I like to watch cooking shows and find it a relief to know someone can find a fun approach to it and your show blah 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 let me know and says now I do not mean no harm at all <laughs> if this is taken wrongly accept my extended apology but I think the man with the brown hair is very good looking and enjoyed watching him and his appeal <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy both of you, it says, and liked your show, Good Luck, for many, many months to come. <laughs> well, I was kind of hoping for an extended play, but I'll, I'll settle for months at this point from uh, Tracy Massey of Richmond, yeah. Virginia. Well, Glad you discovered the show and like it. Thank you. The, these recipes are real long. This and one does look like the one with the brown hair. And, and this one is from mm -hmm. California, but we couldn't read it. Uh, oh, oh, I swear. It's just wild things yes. going on. Wild Terrible. things. Oh, Those people I see in the, California. These onions bad. have jumped out of this hot water right oh, into here. No. I'm going to do some stuffed onions. I thought I'd done stuffed onions one time, but every stuffed onion recipe is a little bit different. Yes. So, and I know that I have not done this specific one. Can I show them just the first step? Yeah, because I'm going to do vegetable purees of various kinds. You so. gonna, does this mean you're going to be smushing up vegetables during it, the it entire does, program? It does. I'm going to oh, be beating stuff Lord. to death. What we do on this particular one, let me just get this out of the way for a second. I will just show you the first step and then we'll get into the rest of it in a minute. You buy yourself four big yellow onions. These are just your basic old yellow onions and Make sure you locate the root side. This is the root side of the onion. Sort of looks a little like little roots hanging out of there. That's uh -huh. how you can tell. Well, you don't want to cut that off. You go to the top side 
and you cut down about a quarter of an inch to a half inch and you just cut that off. And then from there you've got to kind of be real careful like and peel off the very outer edge of it. And what we're going to do is we're going to slip this into some boiling water, all four of these. We'll do this four times and we will put that into boiling water on top of the stove for 10 minutes only. And make sure you get that awful horrible cellophane part off on the outside of it. See, now there's the root side. There's the top side. We're going to be, once we've, we have put this into boiling water for 10 minutes, we'll take it out and we're going to take all that out of there. And boy, you know that's going to be a million laughs here in a couple of minutes. So put those in your hot water and boil them for 10 minutes. That's the first step. And I'm going to start chopping some apples right now and back to Laban. Well now, I'm doing vegetable purees, mashed vegetables, baby food mm, kind of thing, mm, but they'll mm. be spicy and interesting. I know the and, staff's going to be standing oh, around for I this know. when it gets finished today. And the first thing I'm going to work on are my carrots, but I wanted to show everybody this lovely carrot, Larry, that we got. It had Siamese ends. <laughs> <laughs> It is there a, it is. It had two ends on to it. Where well, the, long. Just a, perhaps. Now don't throw it away. Keep it, it. Perhaps you can go in with the circus. With oh, this I don't know. On. I think the farmer had been it, shooting fertility drugs to that. <laughs> make it some real money. Now this is your standard bunch of carrots that came out of a bag, probably about a pound of them. Hmm. And I'm going to put them in our blender. Yes, it's time for the old blender one more time. Return of the blender. So let's put these down in the blender. And I've got some water. I've got about a cup of water in here. And we're going to, there, there are two ways you can do a puree. You can mash the vegetables like we're going to do, or you can do them like this and uh, chop them up before you cook them and it, you get a little bit different texture and it might be real interesting. So let's see what happens. Chop. <laughs> hey, it's amazing. <laughs> well, well, ladies and gentlemen, there you go. <laughs> I think you've ruined it. Oh, there, you just got to reset it and seat it in there. If it's not seated the right way, it just won't work. <laughs> While he's messing with that, hit it. Hit it with, kick it. Um, oh, we think we have a grief. carrot jam. <laughs> Crossways. It's terrible. This, what an aggravation. I swear, oh. this blender has been our nemesis ever since. It really has. It's exploded on us several times. It's terrible. Well, while he's doing boring things, well, he's trying to save the show over there. I'm just chopping these apples. I have to chop up a couple of them. Oh, this and is going to be awful. You just leave the leave the skin right on the outside of them there. It's okay. Just chop them up real fast. In fact, the smaller you can chop them, the better off you'll be, I believe. Are you going to try it again? Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah, we. It's it's looking worse all the time here. It's okay, gonna be tough to do this <laughs> recipe if you don't. Have. It has been ruined for good. Now this tells you, ladies and gentlemen, you ought to try out your equipment before you go on television. <laughs> oh, I'm so mad I could choke this thing within an inch of its life. Oh, come on, do it. We want to see you. <laughs> usually it's usually it's the cameras. <laughs> now you know that a blender ought to chop up a little old measly piece of carrot. Oh, now that's an idea. Now we have all kinds of suggestions rolling in from, from the around the world. Gal, right? uh -huh. The blade's not turning at all. Now you see if the blade doesn't turn on your blender, you've got a big problem on your hands. Oh, that's great. It doesn't even got water. It's intermittent. It's what? So it's intermittent. Somebody has done something to this They've thing. dropped it. <laughs> dropped it on its head. Whew, smells bad, too. That's what happened to Johnson as a child. I think it's loose, and I don't think it's ever going to do anything. Do you have a food, do we have a food mill? 
<laughs> Do we have a food mill over there? Well, Laban, I think you may as well give up on it. Now, if we had a food mill, a hand mill, we'd be all right, but we don't even have that. This cow has <laughs> hardly been hurt. <laughs> Well, you have no choice. You get no. Don't throw it at me. You're just going to have to squish it with something. Um, I can't believe this. This is the most aggravating thing I've ever had happen on this show. Besides that exploding, if you let it do that very long. Well, while he's regrouping, and believe me, he I'm is regrouping, I'm going to take these onions, and this will be the next mess of the day around here. There's and I'm something gonna wrong with this thing. I'm going to try to take the insides out. You take all except the last couple portions of it so that you have something to stuff. <laughs> Boy, that's aggravating. <laughs> I'll swear it's getting so that you can't do anything around here. I've never been so mad in all my life. No, no. <laughs> They're not ever going to be ready. These, well, this these carrots oh, this will never off. be pureed. This oh. is the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. You know, I think no these onions could have gone a little longer, too. <laughs> I seem to be having some problems with those. But hey, you know, this is a part of the fun of being in the kitchen, uh -huh, ladies and sure gentlemen. Is. <laughs> I'm just thrilled. To, oh, I, I think Johnson's going to be squishing these with uh, a couple of forks here in a couple of minutes. He's going to show you what happens when your blender doesn't work, aside from throwing it in the trash can. <laughs> well, you know it should have been there a long time ago, Johnson. You know that's true. We'll just go to the sweet potatoes. Oh, me. I'm having to dig around in here with a knife because this is not as soft as it's supposed to be. And I don't know why, but now it's where's not. my bowl? And I know I'm going to ruin myself with this in a couple of minutes. So I'm going to spend All the right. next well, couple of minutes <laughs> crying. Go ahead, Johnson. <laughs> These uh, sweet potatoes are fiery hot, and uh, I'm going to need a... A, a what you call it, Doris, a spoon. He has lost his vocabulary <laughs> along with the machine. He's incapable of creating sentences now. He's so angry. Well, it is a bad thing to have happen. And I'll tell you, Johnson, <laughs> I'm real sad about it. Well, now I, am. I have roasted these sweet potatoes until they're tender <laughs> in the skin. He always gives me the onion dishes to do. Have you ever noticed that? Yes, because you have a very sensitive nose. I do cry right in the And you just go all to pieces you know, over <laughs> smells. Oh, my heavens. Huh? Oh, it couldn't be. We hadn't even what got are they anything. Oh, yet. no. <laughs> we got a double 15. <laughs> We're going to be eating this stuff raw. Because I'm not kidding you. This is not going well at all. <laughs> This may go down, Johnson, is one of the big disasters of our careers. There we go. <laughs> There's one. I am so mad. Oh, well, now just get over it. You're on television in front of I me. I know, but this blender has humiliated me on television. I don't like it. Well, it's not the first time you're ever humiliated on television. No. It's Won't not be the your first last time either. I've been humiliated in the last week. <laughs> Won't be the last time today, probably. Truth be known about it. Well, excuse me, I'm, I'm continuing on. I'm taking out the innards of this, this onion. And I tell you, this is getting real irritating, this whole thing is. I can't see, he can't squish anything, and, and it's just a mess. In a couple of minutes, I'm going to make up the mix that goes in to this onion, but not just yet. Where did these recipes come from? Now, what are you doing over there now? <laughs> I'm raking the meat out the sweet potatoes. <laughs> we don't want to miss a thing that's oh, going on over there. Lord, and our trash can bag is... Has, any, <laughs> has anybody heard anything about Tom? Is he doing all right? Our, our gentleman that has cleaned up this mess for years. Tom Cornell. Oh, good. Jason Nurses. His, uh, his heart attacked him. And we just hope he's doing all right. Now, I've got an orange, and I'm going to grate some of the peel down in here. This is very appealing. I'm not doing another, I'm not doing another onion. I'm sorry. And these <laughs> carrots will never be pureed. There is no <laughs> way. 
I got to get these things in the oven, so I'm, I'm going to mix some stuff up now. You take uh, about a cup of chopped apples with the skin on, and we're going to mix those in right now with uh, a half a cup of raisins. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I tell you, Johnson, you know, <laughs> There are days, I know, <laughs> I can't get any of this mess to work. <laughs> They're falling out in big clumps. And uh, a cup of bread crumbs. And uh, I'm just going to, what holds this mess together? Oh, I thought I'd margarine. gotten a Good seedless. Heavens, no wonder it won't stay together. I, haven't melted I thought I'd gotten a seedless orange, and this thing has got more seeds in it. What's a quarter of a cup of, of margarine? Is that a stick? Yeah. That's a half a cup. So it's a half of one of these. All right. Give or take a little. Well, it won't take long to get that done. <laughs> mm. oh, but how's your puree coming oh, along over there, Oh, it's going. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I wasn't expecting to be able to be heard during this program today, <laughs> but it has been very silent <laughs> on the old cooking All right, now set. I'm just using a potato masher and a little butter and some orange peel and orange juice and these sweet potatoes. Oh yeah, we have uh, we have something here we need to show. Oh yeah, these fine where all these uh, to sort vegetables. of take their attention off of us during our business. <laughs> where all these vegetables came from? Yeah, we want to show you How our we garden got these, experience. Yes. We have had some extraordinary garden experiences, and uh, we're going to show that to you right now. Some actual footage, as you can see. You see who does all the work in this organization. <laughs> But I guess you have to have an overseer, and, and uh, this is no right. exception. Well, you know, and Larry is oh, kind dear, of, that's terribly a slow learner. Poor Johnson, his toe. If it isn't one thing, it's another. And as you can see, I'm, I'm, I can dig it, and I am right now. At what are we? At, he's just making me work so hard, so fiercely terrible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> dig, dig, dig. It's incredible. <laughs> It really is, but he's not satisfied. No, not satisfied at dig all. a little I deeper. I can't see the That's monitor get out of my way. And yes, and oh, he's still going at it. It's terrible. Oh, well, you got what you deserve. Guys. Oh no. Oh. Oh yes. That's you did. right. It's true. That water went all over and me. As you can see, I'm right happy about it all. I've done the best I can. And just what I got. aggravated me into next week. Now let me show you what I'm going to do here. I've got melted margarine. Thank heavens, margarine melts in a hurry. And I'm going to put that in there, and I'm going to mix this all together. And this is the stuff, as it were, that goes inside of this apple. Now, we're going to put that in there, and we're going to stuff the uh, onion with it. And then we're going to bake it at 350 degrees for 15 minutes. <laughs> 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 well, normally, we would, we would plan to do that. But uh, we're just going to stick it in the oven for as long as we can. Yeah, just stick it. Now, also, you might, you might notice that this hole is a tad bit small that I have made in this. This is just, uh, <laughs> it was all I could get out. I'll be honest with you, I'm sick of this recipe. <laughs> I'm sure it was a good recipe when it started and our intentions were good, but it's just gone awry. Now, take that and put it in the oven and bake it. Goodbye. Now, I'm going to put that in there. You'll notice I went from four to two. <laughs> That's because well, this one over here exploded on me and just sort of blew out the side. Oh, no. You got to be, these are real. I wonder what the secret is to getting these out of here. There must be a secret to it. Woo! I don't know what it is. <sighs> Lord. That's it. Now, how you doing, Johnson? I'm not doing good. Should I, should, I, should I help you out a little bit? Get the salt and pepper. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think I can handle that today. <laughs> salt and pepper. We may want to show these recipes, especially oh. being that nothing we're doing today even slightly resembles these <laughs> recipes. There's the pepper. <laughs> yeah. So here they come. The decorative puree of Beets, roots. Sweet potatoes, carrots, potatoes, <laughs> margarine or cream, appropriate spices. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all there is to it. And make sure you got something that works. Anything.
Oh, the stuffed onions. Four large yellow onions, a cup of chopped apples. Leave the skins on. Chop them up real fine. The finer, the better they are. Half a cup of raisins, one cup of breadcrumbs, quarter cup of melted margarine. Sort of put it all together and stuff that in there. Stick it in the oven and bake it at 350 degrees for 15 minutes. That's what we're doing right now. It's going to be a short 15 minutes. Right. And... Uh, Actually, Miss Witch has got a letter for us, Larry. Oh, if you does wanna, she really? Well, yeah. if she works like everything else has around here today, I don't imagine no, it make much difference one way or the other. <laughs> <laughs> I look like I haven't combed my hair in six weeks. All right. Hey, kids, Effie and me has got so fat you wouldn't believe it. Shoot, we have a... We have to grease her flanks with Crisco to get her in the kitchen. Well, that's, <laughs> that's awful, and it's a very old joke. We are sure <laughs> tired of French dressing, especially Effie, and her blouses are orange on the front. Got any good dressings? B.G. Greens Ralston, Celebrity City, no, Utah. No, Celery oh, City. Oh, Celery City. Oh, I, thought I can't it said celebrity. read. Can't read at all. Well, we'll work on it. I don't know what any of it means. I have no idea. Well... Uh -huh. I guess well, this stuff ought to be doing? coming out of here very shortly, huh? I hope I don't burn my fingers on it. He's going to eat it whether he wants to or not. May as well cut that off. In fact, they could disconnect it after this show. <laughs> I'm not sure it's, any of us will be around for another one. Oh. These now, these carrots are, are over here, but you to. know they're not going to... Uh -huh. I hope it don't slide off the plates, Johnson. I don't want to hurt anybody. <laughs> <laughs> and there's not enough water pressure to clean my tools off with. How you doing, Johnson? I'm not doing too good, Bly. Oh, no. Well, that was a nice idea. <laughs> oh, that's just awful. And the, my beets aren't. Just throw it all they don't, together. No they don't favor notice. nobody. No one will notice. Oh, I, now you got three minutes to save the oh, show. Good. You can do all it, right. Johnson. I've well, seen me... you pull it out with 15 seconds in overtime. I really needed the blender for these beets. Gone it. <laughs> I don't think we're going to choke on it or anything like that. It all started with this double-headed carrot. If he hadn't have brought this in, we'd have been all right today. I have only actually been in the kitchen at home with Johnson one time when he ever had this much misery. Oh, this is aggravating. And I think that was the day that you accidentally roasted your brother, but I'm not sure. I can't <laughs> oh, remember what the who occasion was. deserved it. Yeah. All right, well. What are you doing now? I'm putting them on the serving dish. <laughs> I'm just so disgusted. <laughs> well, it's going to be real colorful with the whites well, and the sure reds. It, is. it would have been orange. It would have been more beautiful if we'd had the the oh, you're going other to burn stuff. that pan all up. I don't think we're going to get to eat any of this. Yeah, you will. I'm afraid so. <laughs> oh, it's so attractive. <laughs> I'm going to go over and sit down. Uh, well, go ahead. <laughs> now, do we I have serving just hardly spoons? wait. Mm -hmm. Do we have serving spoons? Serving spoons? Well, of course we don't, Johnson. Here, let me get some serving spoons. Now, see, this would have been really pretty if we'd had the carrots in there, too. Uh. But there are vegetable purees oh. by the very hardest. Uh. Oh, me. Oh, well, isn't it attractive? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Now, Johnson, let's let's remember I this just, is a food show. Well, <laughs> any fool can see that. <laughs> the way you're flailing that stuff around, throwing it around. Thank you. This is a clean shirt. It's the first time I've done that for a while, so don't ruin it. Oh, this Wait onion a looks. Where's my fork? I don't have a fork. I can't. Oh, you've got it oh, over there. Oh, here it is. I, I haven't flicked on oh, it or anything. Okay. There you go. Well, you try the onion, and I'm gonna try. Uh, now, be careful if they go flying across the room and put someone's eye out. Mmm, <laughs> tastes like mashed potatoes. Mmm, mm, it's real good. Now, what's this stuff? Mmm. Mm -hmm. Tastes like assorted squish things. I think this thing should have cooked longer. <laughs> I can't imagine why you'd say that. It's all real interesting. 
and that's about all I can say about it. Now what this proves is that we all have bad days in the kitchen, and this was a real bad one for us. Well now, these are all right. Yeah, you're good. Ah. 